eye popping dash cam footage of a 12 year old clinging to the roof of a moving SUV moments before the driver is arrested. Deputies were responding to a parking lot takeover at a southeast Harris County shopping center and nearby businesses say they've had enough of that. ABC 13's Brooke Taylor has been looking into the problem for us. Brooke. The precinct to constable's office says they've been getting a lot of calls from nearby businesses, so they've been keeping an eye out on this specific parking lot, but simply they say they don't have enough manpower. So when they have to respond to these type of takeovers, it takes away from other resources. Broken beer bottles and tire marks etched into the ground. This parking lot of a shopping center on Kings Point Road and the Gulf Freeway has become a hot spot for reckless takeovers. And they start doing their spin outs and uh, burnouts and people line up on the side and they watch them. It's, it's kind of like entertainment for them, but they don't realize and understand the, the danger involved. And that's exactly what Constable Jerry Garcia says could have happened at one of the takeovers this past Sunday. Only on 13, watch this alarming dash camera footage of a 12 year old clinging on top of an SUV. You know how fast people drive on feeder roads. So if that little 12 year old would have fallen, he could have easily been run over and killed. The driver, 20 year old Victor Chavez, was arrested for child endangerment. The precinct two constable's office says the families knew each other and Chavez had asked the 12 year old to tag along that night. He told deputies he forgot the boy was on top of his car. These are not professional drivers. Like we tell people, they can lose control and kill somebody. It's happened before. Business owners nearby are also fed up. Employees shared this video with us, telling us takeovers like this happen almost every weekend. They say it pushes customers away and they're forced to clean up the mess. Maintenance comes around once a month, so this happens literally like every week. So you kind of figure we have to clean it up ourselves, you know. Every morning on a Monday morning, it's usually in front of our spot, we clean up about like 20, 30 beer bottles. As of September 1st, state law allows law enforcement to impound cars tied to street racing and reckless driving. In this case, the driver was outside the parking lot, so deputies didn't seize his car. We are not playing. We're not kidding around with these folks. We will seize their vehicles. We will take them to jail. We will write tickets. We will tow vehicles. We've done it before, and I promise you we'll do it again. Enough is enough. I do not want anybody to die in my precinct because this is going on. 